Welcome back to Just Fun Stuff. We are back playing more Detroit Become Human, but before we get started, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Okay, we're back with Kara and Alice and Luther. Find help, check backyard. All right, let's go to the backyard then. There's somebody. I don't know if they'll be helpful, but... Oh, they have an axe. That's concerning. Hello? I'm looking for Rose. Is she here? What do you want with her? I need to talk to her. She doesn't want to talk. Go away. But we need to talk to her, apparently. Please, I really need to see her. I'm Rose. What can I do for you? I was told you could help us. Help you? Okay. Come on. It's better if we talk inside. All right, Rose might be helpful. He doesn't look overly impressed. All right. Do you think we can trust him? Um, we don't have an option, so no yes. Enter. Come in. Poor Alice must be freezing. What's your name? Alice. She's running a fever. We've spent the last few nights outside. She's exhausted. There's her spare room upstairs. You can put her to bed and I'll bring her something to eat. Adam, will you show them upstairs? Okay, let's follow Adam. There we go. Upstairs, guys, let's go. Okay, we're in a room. Now what? Oh, poor Alice. Remove shoes. Undress Alice. Poor thing. Tuck her in. Obviously, she needs to get warm. She's sick. I'm fine, Kara. We can't stop because of me. We've got to get across the border. Reassure her. We need rest. Get a good night's sleep and we'll set off again tomorrow. Why do humans hate us? We didn't do anything wrong. Misunderstanding or it's complicated? Maybe it's a misunderstanding. Maybe they just need time to understand what we really are. Why can't we just talk to each other? They'd see we're not bad. Be sincere. I don't know. I really don't know. I don't know what you like, but I made you Rose's world-famous spaghetti. You'll be back on your feet in no time. 
There's something for her fever. Thank you. I'll get these washed and dried. Okay, we like Rose. Rose is sweet. <laughs> Just eating. Yeah, she needs to eat. You need to eat something. You haven't had anything since we left. Promise me you'll try? I'll be downstairs if you need anything. Take care of Alice. Get some sleep. Close the curtains. Tomorrow, you'll be stronger than me. I'll stay with her a while. Ask Rose about crossing the border, so we need to go talk to Rose. Okay. Need to exit said room. And go down and talk to Rose. Let's see what she has to say, because we have a border to cross. Wants us to look. Lots of pictures of birds and animals and stuff. There's Rose. Go talk to her. I didn't get your name. I'm Kara. This is my son Adam. I'm Rose, but you know that already. Come and have a seat, Kara. So are you going to tell me what a deviant's doing in the snow with a little girl? Let's be sincere. Her father was beating her. When I saw what was happening, something snapped inside of me. All of a sudden I felt like her life was more important than mine. I had to protect her. So we ran away. I understand. Many deviants, Rose. Let's talk about Rose. You and your son live here alone. My husband passed away two years ago. Adam and I, we've just been trying to scrape by. We grow vegetables to sell at the market. <laughs> we'll never be rich, but there's always food on the table. That's important. Many deviants, why help? Why are you helping us? Most humans hate androids. My people were often made to feel their lives were worthless. Some survived, but only because they found others who helped them along the way. Many deviants. We're not the first ones to come here. These past few weeks, we've seen more and, and more. I don't know what's going on, but something's happening. Order. We've heard you help androids cross the border. Can you help us? She doesn't look overly it's impressed. The river, and it's mostly frozen in winter. It's very risky. And after that android speech on TV, everybody's on edge. It's probably safer for you to stay here until things settle down. We have no choice or do we insist? No choice. You can't keep hiding like this. Alice needs to feel safe and have a normal life. We have to get across that border. No matter what. Please. You've got to help us. Rose, come quickly. Okay. Stand. Follow. What's going on? It's Mary. She Mary? We escaped together. We used to talk about what we would do once we got across the border. Aww. I loved her. I loved her more than anything. 
What will I do without her? Is he crying? Oh. Let's let them be. That's so sad. And why Alice? is Alice out of bed? What are you doing? You should be resting. I wasn't sleepy. Aww. Stay or take Alice outside? Take Alice outside. She didn't want to stay in her room any longer. You all right, Kara? Yes. I'm fine. Okay. Let's go over here. We can't hide them. Not after what those deviants did today. It's too dangerous. Do you know what will happen if the police find them here? We'll go to prison, Mom. Do you understand me? Prison! Adam! We've already talked about this. I, uh, no! I won't back down this time. You're gonna ruin our lives, and for what? Adam for is fired machines? up. They are not machines! They are alive! I'm alive! You're alive! They... They're nothing! And none of this would be happening if Dad was still here. I will not stand for that kind of talk. I'm not going to prison because you want to help these freaks. That is enough, Adam! That's enough! Oh, Rose is mad. Okay. Did we talk to Rose? Yes. Let's go over and talk to Rose, because she's seemingly not okay. Don't mind him. Sometimes he just boils over. It's been hard since his dad passed away. Oh, why is this storyline so heartbreaking? But he's a fine boy. I'll go see about getting you across the border tonight, okay? You stay here. I won't be long. See Rose, check what's going on. We've pretty much accomplished it all, so... Talk to Alice, maybe? Oh, it says read. World War Three. Okay. Talk. I hope Rose gets back soon. She just Kara. left. There's something I need to tell you. Okay, Luther. It's about Alice. Not now, Luther. Um, I feel like that's important. Wait for Rose, look around, talk to Adam. All right, where do we find Adam? He stormed off. Oh, he's on the couch. Turn on. There is widespread shock following the android attack on Detroit's Stratford Tower. The machines recorded a video message and broadcast what can only be described as demands on the city's public screens. It's still unclear whether these attacks can be explained by malfunctions or if some organization is behind them. So far, CyberLife has refused to comment, but we can expect more information in the following hour. Yep. And off. All right, let's talk to Adam. Rose. 
Reassure, confess. I can see why you're angry. We don't want to cause any problems, we just want to get across the border. Um, the police. It's the police. That's bad news, bears. What are we gonna do? Open door, find evidence of deviant. Three left. Doing. We have to open the door. I knew this was gonna happen. I knew it. What do we have to do? We have to open the door. Run, guys. Good evening, ma'am. Sorry to disturb you. We've had reports of androids in the area. With all this deviant business going on, you can't be too careful. Do you mind if I ask you a few questions? Absolutely not. May I come in? Of course. Good evening, young man. Good evening. Okay. This is my heart Would is pounding. Like I'd love one. Have you noticed anything unusual recently? Any unexpected visitors? Suspicion no. levels only at 25%. No, in is Wait. anyone else in the house? Uh make coffee? Uh no, no just us. We went with you nobody. Nope. No, there are no androids here. Pour coffee. Oh, my heart's pounding. I feel like this is not gonna go well. What's with the blue blood? I thought you didn't have any androids. What blue blood? Where's blue blood? Mess. Previous owner? No one? Previous owner. Let's go with previous... I went with previous owner. No idea what that's doing there. Okay, you just rose his suspicion level to like 200%. Um... Shit. Don't move! No, Luther! <gasps> oh, Luther down. And Alice watched. You're gonna have to finish the journey without me. And we're out, Luther. Awesome. Luther! Okay, does that sound like the car? I'm hoping. Get yourselves ready. Get is no tonight. There's nobody concerned that there's a policeman on the floor. So midnight train, we we're down, Luther. That's okay. We didn't make all the best choices, but that's okay. Um, my heart was pounding. But now we have some big stuff coming. We're leaving. We're heading for the border. I'm going to leave that for my next video. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and I will see you then.